what's going on Terry RK <clears throat> back with another video in this video as you can see in the back is going to be a strategy so it's going to be a RTS real-time strategy for the Xbox 360 and this video is going to probably be two parts first one because I think I have a, like 11 11 or 10 games so I don't want to make the video too long so I'm gonna cut them up into two parts so it's, it's going to be part one, then part two, but it's going to be uh, part whatever, but it's going to be two back to back. So you see this video, it's going to be a second video after this one. <clears throat> it's going to be about real time strategy for the Xbox 360. They do have a lot of exclusives for Xbox 360. You can't get them on any other platform. Only you could probably get it on the PC, but well i'll show you what i have and go grab you your rts if you're rts fans grab it for the xbox 360 exclusive some of them are most of them are more than half are exclusive the other ones other three or four <clears throat> basically you can get it on like ps3 and other platforms and the pc but let's get into it before the store closes um july 29th xbox live and before the whole company shuts down and the servers that wipe up all the digital stuff and you will be able to play your digital or anything you can play just a physical copy offline mode no updates no patches plug and play Xbox 360 go grab your copy copy of games and consoles and let's get on to it <clears throat> first one is going to be was it ours what you call it it's going to be r u s e and it's going to be the art of deceptions this is the rts game you can pick it up on any platform i think um ps3 this one's not an exclusive one but there you go check the back of it so you can look at the upc if you want to put this one up but this is a good one to get because you can play um <clears throat> tanks uh was it um ships Aircrafts, it's like war. So this is a good one too to get pick up if you're an RTS fan or if you just like the games. So let's go and crack this up. Here goes the manual. <clears throat> Nothing in the back. That's how it looks in the back of the manual. Here goes the game disc. <clears throat> Gonna get to sleep for this one. <clears throat> Excuse me, I have bad allergies right now. There goes a um, game disc. I'm gonna look at the game. It's in very good condition, like new. I'm gonna pop this over, put it in the sleeve. R U S or R's. Pop that back into the game. So basically there's going to be two parts for the RTS. They have a little bit more <clears throat> in this category, what I have. So this is the first game disc, it's right here, Xbox 360, physical copy. Not talking about anything else. This is all physical only for the people who want physical games. So this is the first one, put that down. The next one is going to be a Blade Storm, was it? <clears throat> the hundred years war for the Xbox 360 this is not exclusive I think you can get this on the ps3 and not too sure what other consoles you can get <clears throat> as you can say this is the one in the background right there it's mostly like a destiny destiny warriors RTS vibe for this one let me get the UPC for you if I, oh no UPC sorry I can't show that to you but I can let me see, you, I'll, I'll open it and you can look at the UPC. <clears throat> there goes the back picks artwork. Check that out. Okay, let me look. Manual. That's how it looks in the back. <clears throat> Game disc. Let me take this out and I'll show you the back UPC. I'm going to get the game disc out and put it in a protective sleeve. <clears throat> there goes the game disc. I'm going to look at the disc, see what kind of condition. Yep, and like new condition. 
put that in. Put this one to the side. I'm gonna slide this open <clears throat> so you can check out the UPC if I can get this open without trying to rip the cover. Okay, got that out. Okay, so there goes the UPC for that one. Close that up. See if it's, everything's up, not completely in. Okay, it should be good. <clears throat> okay, that's how I look. And put the game disc back in. Okay, and that is Blade Storm for Xbox 360. This is game two. And this is not exclusive for the Xbox 360, but now these other games now is going to be exclusive for Xbox 360. So basically, you only can get it, play it on the console Xbox 360. Some of them might be backwards compatibility, but you don't want to worry about that <clears throat> because, like I said, Xbox One, Xbox Series S, not too sure if they're going to shut the servers down, shut whatever they're going to do in the future. You won't probably be able to play your backwards compatibility games in the Xbox One and up. Only way you can start playing these physical copy games only in the Xbox 360. <clears throat> so the next game is going to be was it Warhammer uh, Battle March for the Xbox 360. So this one is exclusive only for the Xbox 360. You won't see it up here. Because it, it just it just says Xbox 360. Um, this is only exclusive for Xbox only. You only can play this on Xbox and maybe some PC. So that's M for Mature. So hopefully, yep, there's no UPC. I will open that up. And this is how it looks like in the back. If you can see that from the glare, I can't see anything when I'm looking through my lens of the camera. And that's how it looks. So check that out. But I will open it up. <clears throat> Crack it open. There goes the manual. So it looks like in the back. Game disc. Then I'm going to give me a sleeve for that one. <clears throat> Pop that open. Get the game disc out. And game disc. Look in the back of it. Very good condition, like new, no scratches or anything that that, no smudges. So put that in the sleeve. The weather changed where I live. That it's getting kind of hot. Now, so I'm getting a little um, allergy. So put that to the side. Check the back out. Slide that down for a little bit. See so if I can get that out. Okay, you won't see, see, you won't see the Xbox right here. It's supposed to be exclusive. This is for Xbox exclusive, but it, it doesn't show it. You won't know it if you're going to a store or if you check online. All you see is just going to see the Xbox 360. But this is a UPC right there. But this is only exclusive for the Xbox 360 if you want to get it. Pick it up, play for the console. No digital, no downloads, no updates, no patches, plug and play for the Xbox 360. <clears throat> and put back the inserts, manual. So, only exclusive for the Xbox 360. If you want, pick this RTS up, the exclusives. If you're going to pick it up, go for the exclusive ones first and then go for the other ones like these other two right here. Pick them up last because you do, you can pick up for either console. This is the one that you want to go for before the store closes and before Xbox company shuts down. Pick these up. Don't you want to snooze and don't lose. Don't cry now. You know, when you don't pick them up. So the next one <clears throat> is another exclusive for the Xbox 360. This is made by Sega. Universe at War. 
can't see that what it says earth assault <clears throat> excuse me <clears throat> so this one doesn't say exclusive but this is exclusive for the xbox so if you want to play this on universe at war rts game go grab your copy before everything's too late you don't want to cry later when i tell you now there goes the upc that's how it looks pics in the back if you want to get a collection for the rts real-time strategy their invasion has just begun you be on the side spine once again in the front front looks good got that invasion was it alien type robot <clears throat> gonna crack this open and there goes the game disc manual I don't know what that is it's probably a little spot right there okay this is what it looks like in the back got a few games back there I think from Sega <laughs> gonna get a game uh, sleeve for this one get it in the protective so we'll get scratched cracked if you drop it it's okay because it's in the sleeve okay I'm gonna pop up with the game and check out the game disc what kind of condition <clears throat> this is in very good condition but the only thing is just has like little smudges you can wipe that off but game disc protect your sleeve so this one's only exclusive for the Xbox 360 like I said this is going to be a number two after this video it's going to be the second part this is the universe at war for Xbox 360 this is the exclusive RTS so grab this before it's too late before Xbox store closes and before the company goes out of business it's gonna be a domino effect for all the old games what you call retro games physical copy games digital don't worry about digital just leave them digitals alone you're just gonna waste your money and time on that get the physical copies so that's the exclusive that's number four so we got two more to go <coughs> So next one is, is another exclusive. So all your Lord of the Rings fans, this is a good one for you. Lord of the Rings, the battle for Mid-Earth 2. Only other way you could probably play this is on the PC. Yeah, this is only exclusive for the Xbox 360. You don't see it right here, but this is only exclusive. You can go online and check it out. You won't find it in any other consoles at the PS3. Maybe for the PC, you can. It goes to UPC. Have you look in the back. So if you're um, Lord, of the Rings, Lord of the Rings fans, you like this. All them characters command your um, at your command. Got dragons and all that stuff. Whatever you're seeing in the Lord of the Rings in this game right here exclusive only for the Xbox 360 get your copy right now there goes the game disc manual that's only if you're into physical games I mean physical copy stuff you can get the digital if they have a digital but you know better just to get the physical because you don't know what the feature is going to hold game disc manual Put this on the sleeve. <clears throat> okay, I'm gonna pop open the disc, see what the condition it is. So there goes the um, game right there, game disc. Check out the back. Yes, very like new. Put this back in the sleeve, see that protection. So I want this game to last. So when the video game apocalypse comes and hits, I'll be prepared for everything. I've got all my physical. Put that back in. 
only exclusive for the Xbox 360. Lord of the Rings, the battle for Mid-Earth. So if you like that game, so if you like the movie, if you like RTS, you get both in one. So this is only exclusive for Xbox 360. So that is the physical copy. So we will go to the last game. So that is game number five. So we're going to hit game number six. <clears throat> so game of the six is the same thing. If you like the Halo, as you can see, Xbox exclusive, Halo Wars. So if you like the um, Halo, you get it. If you and if you like RTS, you get two in one. All the Halo fans and RTA fans, RTS fans, and then it goes to UPC for that one. Back at the. Um, artwork look at that looks nice take control of the halo universe <clears throat> just do your research if you like these kind of rts games pick this one up if you're a halo fan this only exclusive only way you can play this game is only on the xbox 360 <laughs> It could be backwards compatibility, but you don't know how long you can play that backwards compatibility in the future. Everybody's saying that, oh, you can get this digitally on Xbox One and up. I'm not worried about that. You know, that could be taken down anytime. So once you have your physical, they can't take that away from you. It'll always be in your library, on your hands anytime, 24 seven, whenever you want to play it. Rain or shine. Offline, don't need no internet to play this. No digital updates, no patches. Offline mode, Halo Wars RTS. So let me pop that open. You have the game disc, and then you have the manual, and then you check out the back right here. So that has looks like in the back of the manual, and then you do get your top accessories controllers I guess hard drive internet cable microphone all the good stuff that's before you can play online but no more then you got your um, Wi-Fi adapter your headset if you want to do some trash talking when you go online that's only back in the days but no more they took that away from you guys only you could do that on Xbox 360 and some of the we call it Xbox One before you get kicked off, you trash talk too much, get get suspended or get banned. Okay, so here goes your game disc. Gonna check out in the back, see what kind of condition it is. Put it in a game sleeve. RTS fans better go jump on this one before you won't be able to play these only exclusive games, Halo Wars and uh, Lord of the Rings. So let me look at the back of the disc and see what kind of condition. A uh, little bit light scratches, but I can buff that out. And I did play this, it does work in the system. If it works in the system, it has a little bit light scratches. I don't really do anything unless it skips or if it does something to the Xbox where I can't play, I would have to do some resurfacing. But in that, it's still in condition right now. So pop that in. Xbox exclusive RTS Pop that and there you go. Halo Grab this one up if you want to go for the RTS Like I said, this is part two. This is part one. So the next video I'm gonna put up is gonna be part two for the RTS because it was kind of a lot that I have for the RTS in my in my library so if you want to grab grab this one because it is exclusive so I'm gonna show you the recap of what we have. So you got ours, that's so you can get that on any console. Blade Storm. These two you can get on PS3 or PC. But these last let me see, last four right here is only exclusive for the Xbox 360. I'll let you look back at it. Universe at War, uh, Lord of the Rings, um, was the Middle Earth and then Halo Wars 
these four are only exclusive for the Xbox 360. So if you had to pick any of these up, go for these fours right here, four of these right here, and then go for the rest. You want to get these out of the way because they're exclusive. And then if you can't, eat, there's no place you can play them. They'll probably these ones will probably go up in value when people find out about these games, exclusive RTS games. These are the ones that's going to go up in value right here. Besides these ones right here. These are, you can get them on PS3. So, go for these right here first. And then go for the rest. The next one has some more exclusive for the Xbox 360 for the RTS. So, I will see you in the next video after this one. So, this is part one. Then, part two is going to be uploaded after this one so until next time terry arcade later